Hi, this is Salas Ames with another video for you, and by popular demand, the topic of today's video is going to be small breasts. And you'll notice that I'm wearing two bras. I'm wearing my one push-up bra and a sports bra. But 90% of the time, I don't wear bras because I have 36A breasts, and I don't really need to. So uh, I just want to talk about that and maybe talk on a uh, touch on a few heavier subjects later on, and then hopefully end on a positive note. But, um, so, uh, when I was 16, I went on birth control for a while and my breasts grew from an A to a B. And it was kind of interesting, but I also, I really didn't like it. I was walking up the stairs and I'd be like, oh wait, something's bouncing. Whoa, you know, I had to hold them so they didn't bounce up and down because they hurt when they bounced. So that, and that was a very new experience for me. And I didn't like it, so I went off the birth control. Even though it was a low estrogen dose, it still had that effect on me. And uh, I went back to having uh, small breasts, and I was uh, very happy with that. And I s saw a lot of external messages, very negative messages about that, saying, if you don't have um, you know, a certain size breast cup, then you're not really a woman, you're, you look like a little boy, um, you know, you're, you know you're, you're sort of excluded from a lot of discourse in this country about being a woman. You know, even little things like, oh, it's so great when you just come home from work and take your bra off. And, you know, I, I don't relate to that. And um, I, I don't like it when I hear that, oh, every woman has these problems of, of uh, you know, having breasts and so forth, because I, I really don't. Um, but at the same time, I don't want to put down people who have those problems. I don't want to put down people who are uncomfortable because they have large breasts and they just want to, you know, go out wear something cool in the summer. But you know, men keep staring at their chests and, and hooting at them. I mean, that's, uh, you know, I don't want to put those people down to have a good body image about me having small breasts. So, uh, but what I, I do want to look at some of the, you know, racial stereotypes around that. And I think this is the really sad part, but when I was young, I was about 12 years old, and I read a joke book. And the joke book had, uh, you know, I'm, I'm going to take off this push-up bra, actually, because it's making me feel kind of silly. Okay, so this is my normal sports bra. You can see it, you know, don't really have that much up there. But, um, and I read the section on Asians, and it had a joke about Asian women that said, invent a Chinese woman with big tits and the world will be the path to your door. And that joke has kind of haunted me for a long time because I, you know, it, it really just gets to the core of racial fetishizing of Asian women. And some women who are not white are fetishized as inhuman and animalistic, whereas Asian women are fetishized as inhuman and inanimate, doll-like, robot-like, uh, passive, receptacles, uh, works of art, uh, unfeeling. And, um, you know, that, that's, it, it's so horrifying to be kind of fit into that category, to say, oh, oh, you know, you exist only as an idealized image of a white man's fantasy, and you don't even fit that image. You know, you're not, because, I mean, I'm, you know, I'm a, I'm, I'm not, I, I'm not slim and small-breasted in the, uh, you know, model type way. I'm shaped like a rectangle, not a stick. But, uh, so that joke really made, it also made me very angry, and I, I was like, you know, I, I don't accept that. I just, I absolutely refuse to accept that. And, um... So if you have small breasts, you, you don't have to be ashamed about that. I mean, there's just, you have to sort of work on developing your confidence, developing uh, your body image, finding good things about your body. And I'm not saying, oh, plastic surgery is wrong and evil, but we shouldn't be forced to, you know, to believe that we are only desirable human beings if we get plastic surgery, if we get the approved breast size. Um, so it's, it's, I think it's very difficult for Asian women sometimes who are kind of trapped in the middle of all these messages. And we just, we have to like look inside ourselves 
and find what we're happy with and find peace and just live our lives according to that. And like I said, I like having small breasts. If I want to have big breasts, like if I'm, you know, uh, cosplaying or something, then, you know, there's, there's push-up bras, you know, I can, I can play around with it. Um, it's, it's, it's a good thing for me. So um, uh, I guess that's about as positive a way as I can end it on. And I hope everyone has a good week. And until next time, bye.